Thanks for watching News 8 at 11. I'm Eric Conner. I'm Stella Escobedo. We start with breaking news. A bow fire and a search for survivors. This is about two miles off the coast of Carlsbad near Sequoia Avenue. News 8's Chris Crow joining us live at the U.S. Coast Guard Station. Good morning, Chris. Good morning, Eric and Stella. And, and look, even though this is off the coast of Carlsbad, we know that Oceanside lifeguards were the first ones to respond here to this boat fire to try to find some survivors. But sadly, in their initial search, they did not find anybody in the water. Now, if you take a look here at some video that we shot just a short time ago from Chopper 8, you can see that the U.S. Coast Guard now using their cutter in order to search for survivors. And then also, you could still see that boat there also still smoldering. Now, it was Oceanside Fire Battalion that confirmed to us the name of this boat. It is called the Relentless. It is based in Oceanside, and it does appear that this is a fishing charter boat. Now, according to some of those public records that we're able to look up, this was a boat that was been built in 1986. It's about a 50-foot long vessel, uh, but so far, no glaring records or any deficiencies or anything like that spotted in our search so far, even though it is pretty still early on. Uh, now, again, we are still trying to figure out exactly exactly how many people may have been on board at the time of this fire. We're also, as is the Coast Guard, trying to find out if potentially another boat may have taken survivors from the water at any point. But the lifeguard and fire department in Oceanside telling us that they have not heard any reports of that. So this is a really daring and pressing time right now when you have one of these boat fires. You're initially looking for those survivors that may be within the water uh, or maybe uh, swimming nearby uh, being so far from shore. So again, that is what they are doing right now. Uh, we've had our chopper in the air getting that bird's eye view there of that shot. But back out here live again, we are at the US, U.S. Coast Guard here in downtown San Diego. We know that they are going to be having their helicopter involved in the search as well as that cutter boat uh, that is there live there in those pictures that we just showed you a short time ago. So again, we are waiting to find out exactly if and when we might get any more information about potentially if they were in the middle of a charter, uh, a, you know, a longer trip there, how many people were on board. And again, if any survivors have been found and we'll be sure to update you throughout this midday show. Eric and Stella.